Okay, this is the crocodile. And this is like $50. Just about anywhere you want to get it at. Um, and really the better deal is at Joanne Fabrics. Because Michaels only has a 20% off coupon. And this one, they had a 40% off coupon because it was regular price. So I ended up paying like 20 bucks for it. And uh, that's well worth it because this has got a six inch reach. Okay. It has a real long reach. And that's neat because these, this is a mini one, but I've got three big giant ones. But they're still are short ranged. And they're a little bit bigger than this one. And they press way better than this does. This is like a hyper tough one for five bucks at Walmart. It's good. That's all you have. Um, but this one punches holes and sets eyelets. Um, and it'll work leather and metal and plastic and all kinds of things. Which you'd never be able to do that with the other kind. But this is really neat. They used to sell the whole kit on Home Shopping Network when they came out. And it was like 30 bucks with a giant kit. Then it went to like $67 for a kit. And now they just, I guess they don't have the kits. You just have to buy the tool and then buy all the stuff separate. I don't know how much stuff comes in this thing. So we're going to open it up and look. We can get it. It has a thing where you can open it in the back, but it looks like a pain in the butt. I don't think it's going to happen that way. Because I don't want to cut the direction board up. Let me try it with this. Because I'll put this in a case anyway. With all my bits. I've got a shoe box with my other tools that I use. Um, but this is a lot easier to use because I'm going to tell you these little pliers, they, they are really hard to press them down. Um, I don't care how old you are. And sometimes they don't press straight. And so you'll smash the thing up and you got to argue to try to get it off of there. But this has a little more direct power and uh, a little more leverage to it when it's set like this. Plus you can see exactly where you're going with it. The other ones you can kind of see. So... Got a big there back in it. So here's a direction board. Reach point, set eyelets. And it says you could do some inserts too. It's really sad that they don't give any parts to it. Ugh. Yep, I don't think anything comes with it. That's kind of a dud. Yep, not a thing comes with it. Wow. You'd have thought they'd give you some little sample stuff. Okay, so. Comes with a little instruction thing. It's really heavy duty. It'll stand alone by itself. Okay. And you've got. That's for the eyelet things, which is these doodads. These little things. So they go like this. And it's like what you use for like a shoelace hole. Okay. And so that's your eyelet setting there. And then it's got little boxes that turn. 
so you can rotate your pusher and I have a small on the big which I like this big I think that'll work good and then it's got that one that one and that one the flying saucer one the silver flying saucer is probably the one to use and then you slide it down because what it does is these things these, they're supposed to spread out so when you put it on your fabric or whatever you're using it on then the oops, it's hard to do but here's a little holder so your little doodah will go on there and it goes like that and presses it down and then it's got two puncher holes this one and this one this big one and this little one you set for one eighth. Ooh. There's a one eighth, and this one's a three sixteen. Okay, so the three sixteen is this bigger one, and see it, it's right like that. See it go. Now here's a little one. See, and then it um. Let's see on off I don't know why that I guess that's for the whole cover I don't know how that would move though but anyway the little trash parts will come out out here and then it's got rulers for whatever it is you're making there's one eighth one eighth inch hole ruler setting that one's for the eyelet setting and this bottom one's the 3 16th hole so you can measure your fabric from this hole yep so that's pretty cool and here's a little stabilizer so you can change the this width so when you go to load your fabric or your paper in just put it to that little stabilizer and it holds it if it needs to be further you just do it like that so see pretty cool huh it's nice. I like the colors, okay? And this is a rubbery handle. And it's very sturdy. The feet, it stays pretty good. It's got little feet on it. But it's real nice. I mean, it's it's about as heavy as a, a staple gun. Probably a little heavier. Right, this is Cropodile 2 is what they call it. Cropodile Big Bite 2. And uh, here's all the stuff you can use to make it work with. And, um, it tells you how to use it. But you can use it on plastic and leather and metal. Like tin. Like lightweight metal. Thin tin. So like an aluminum can probably. And um, that's pretty neat. That is pretty neat. So, I hope you enjoyed that. Go get yours. You better go get it at Joanne's, that's for sure. That's a deal. They also have a thing where you can buy them in quantity, too. Like six of them at a time and stuff. So, um, you, just, you don't want to put your fingers in there. If a child is using it, make sure they have supervision. Because you don't want to put their fingers in here. you got to use this part. And if you want to, you can use two hands. But that's pretty neat. I'm happy. Because I can do a lot of eyelids. <laughs> anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Hope you have a great one.